Well, <clears throat> Sunday morning, that one dead tree I was showing y'all, I there pushed most of it down. There she is in the back of the truck, right as right it could be. But the stump was still pretty solid in the ground. While cutting the grass, and trying to use the lawnmower as a bush hog too, I snagged this chain. <clears throat> so I just took it and wrapped it around it a couple times. Wrapped it around that a couple, my ball a couple times. And poured it on out. Which I knew it was, it was right because I could push it and it'd go a little bit, but I didn't want to follow the face forward first and all them thinner bushes, so that's what I used. I'll show you what it looks like here in a few minutes to y'all. It'll be just a few sec excuse me, it'll be a few seconds to me, it'll probably be a few hours or more. I'll see you in a minute. Ugh. It's raining on us boys and gals, children of all ages. Got another, uh, got another load out in the woods. Can't, uh, can't even talk right now, I'm so tired. Got my second load for the day. Little pile's getting bigger and bigger. Well, yeah. let's get this unloaded and maybe the rain that's like up a little bit more and we can get us another load or two or we call it crits today. I'll see y'all in a second or two. Well, I pushed the tree over there and then I hooked the chain up to it and drug it off. It's got them pushing this tree over by hand. The English ivory has killed it. That one looks like it's still alive, but I don't know. That one might be dead. I don't know. Well, I think I thought it's got some, got some leaves on top, so maybe I, I can get the ivy off of it before it kills it. All I've been doing is just sitting here and uh, trying to cut it. Trying to get these in, pliers and print it. And pry it off and cut. Let's see. Maybe okay, we'll get my axe. Get this one. Ah, I got it. Come right here and get this next one. Try to get all around it. Ah. I know this video camera is every tree but loose. Man, that goes all the way over here. Yeah, that one goes down. Uh, yep, I'm gonna get the axe out I'm afraid. Unless I can pry it off. Mm. Probably gonna end up doing more damage to the tree than anything. Trying to get that baby bad boy out. There we go. Whew. It's hard to do this. Like I said, my GoPro's dead. There we go. Oop. Got my hand over it. I'll have to get it. Start pulling it now. Look at that big old vine. Oh, that broke there. That, oh, that one broke. <sighs> That's all I've been doing, y'all. Take all these vines out of the trees. 
trying to save them. I may save it, I may not, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I just did. I might have y'all upside down for a few minutes. If I did, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> about to rip my mouth. Yeah. Then I flip flopping this phone around and... Uh, I don't know if y'all ever had any issues with the poison, not poison ivy, but uh, with the English ivy on trees. I'm not sure, just taking it off the bottom, just pouring what I can off of it, it's gonna save them or not. But if you've ever had any issues with this, let me know what y'all did in comments and uh, if it worked or if it didn't work. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Cause I need both hands to get all this cut up. Uh, we got all these little trees taken out of here, like this little thing here, a little pile there. <laughs> she got them, uh, she got those uh, dirt and stuff in the English ivy in my mouth. I'm, I'm gonna probably take those little trees out. Anything small I'm gonna take out of here. Like I said, I don't know if some of these trees are alive or not anymore. My tree looks like it's still alive. Oh, it is. Yeah, I pushed on it. It's okay. That one's okay. That one looks dead. I might be able to push it. Both of them over. Oh, there it goes. Woo! This right here looks dead. Yeah, I'm afraid if I push it that way, it's going to hit my truck. Whoa! They almost hit us in the head. That one's alive. Nope, that one's dead. Hung up that Oh, got a riddle maker up there. Timber! Timber! Almost. I caught another limb. See if we can't hit it. Ah, that's two more trees I pushed over. There's like a third tree right here I might be able to push over. Nope, that one's still alive, believe it or not. Okay. Uh, hey. Another set of tree. I think it's dying though. I don't know why. If I get some light in here to make it live. Yeah, it's still alive. That one's dead. Whew. Got a lot of dead trees out here. That one's dead too, it looks like. Oh, no, no, it's got leaves in it. It may still be alive. Yeah, it's alive. Huh. Well, like I said, i right here trying to get ivy off of these so it won't kill every one of them. Trying to make room for daylight to get through here for a lot of these other trees. That tree really looks dead. I hope not, because this right there beside the... Here, I'll show you. I'm right there, on the left. Right here beside the tree house. Hope it's not dead. It looks like it, though. Uh, if it is... I have to go. Hope we don't take the treehouse out. It's not for the granddaughter to play in it, but if it takes it out, that's fine. We'll build another one. Oh man, oh man, I got so much to work to do. I don't got enough time in the day for it. Thank y'all for watching my videos. God bless you. Uh-oh. Uh Look at this. Stump there, it rotted bad. Look, they come up. Oh, a flower plant pot. Uh. Yep. There we go. I redid all this out. Maybe plant some good flowers in here. I get redid it out and get the get all the uh, leaves raked up and all this crap picked up. They got them dead tree limbs and stuff. But that's why I was looking at the tree stump. I put my foot up against it. Yeah, that tree stump's gone. It rotted. Oh. Yeah, pick up all this little branch. Oh, hit the wrong button. Got to pick up all these little branches and stuff out here. Get them holly bushes out. Get all that ivory out of them trees as much as I, have it as, as I can. I want that set of tree to make it. I want that set of tree to make it. Ah. Uh. 
That's it, man. We got so much work to do, not enough time to do it, really. Raining like crazy now. Hey, I didn't notice that. So that's what my wife was talking about yesterday. People nailed uh, limbs and stuff up here. I guess they did it for birds. I'm not really sure why they did that. Uh, gotta check the plugs out over there. I gotta bring a light out here to check that plug out. There's a plug in that one. And you can't see it from here. I'll walk up that closer to it. There's a plug right in the center of that one. See it right there? Silver. Uh, you can sit that. You should have both sit now. Uh, I'm not sure where uh, they use all this far, but uh, I'll figure it out eventually. Got got to love buying a new place. Don't know what's going on with it, but uh, so they get this all cleaned out, looking good. I'll take a video of it, let y'all see how it looks then. And uh, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do this area. I'm thinking about fencing it off a little bit through here, putting some goats out here to eat. I'm thinking about buying me some electric fencing. It'd be nice because the neighbor's dog. Uh, not sure if I told y'all or not. Uh, neighbors right here, the woods. You should be at the house now. Uh, my fingers ain't working on this. On this, uh, water's getting on the screen and making it hard to operate. But uh, neighbors got a pit bull. Everybody in the neighborhood has warned me. Watch out for the bull. Pit bull, that is. He's mean as a snake. He'll sneak up on you, and he will get you. I've been carrying my Glock, uh, not Glock. I'm used to my Glock 17, but uh, I've been carrying my Taurus 9mm out here. In case he sneaks up. But yesterday when I was mowing the grass and the leaves over there and some of the tree limbs down, or trees, small trees down, they came up, got real close to him before I realized he was there. Ugh. But I gotta get an electric fence put up around through here. Give me some goats put out here to help eat all this vines and stuff down maybe they can kill this uh poor uh i think they poison ivy but english ivy and i just noticed another dead limb right there oh no anywho i gotta get back to work uh thank y'all for watching my videos i know i probably don't make sense on a lot of this stuff uh, i've had a count for nine nine or more years and didn't post much on it because i've been busy uh, i'm not too up to date on tech so i'm still learning how to do all this and uh if, if it's a bad video hey just let me know hey uh video could do this or that i'll take all all your criticism you know if it's a creative criticism i take it if it just being a bs criticism or want to try to be a smart ass i'm not into that i'll delete you throw you out of here i don't care but if you want to give me some critical, uh, creative criticism, I'll take that. And I'm going to end the video here because I got a lot of work doing. It's raining, like I said. But fencing is going to be next. Uh, electric fence. Raph don't know about it yet, but get electric fence, go down to the farm. Uh, get maybe two, three goats, mentor goats, bring it here and let them eat all this reads up and i'll move the electric fence over here to the close to the highway and let them eat all that grass down and hopefully it all you know turn out pretty good but god bless y'all thank y'all for watching if you got any ideas that can help me out I, hey i'm all ears Woo, look, i got some big ears see Woo. but uh yeah I, I think any kind of information i can get uh house rise i gotta i gotta replace some wood on the outside you know the easy way of taking the wood out replacing it putting it back in but making it look ugly i'm not a woodworker i'm a welder by trade now i can take metal and i can do just about anything i want to with it but wood mm, man it don't get along too good so like i said i'm gonna end the video here before i keep rambling along uh god bless y'all thank y'all for watching uh Pray for our country. God knows we need it. Pray for our president.
He needs it. And more. Hey, score. Let's see if y'all see this one. Oh, he disappeared. Anywho, uh, God bless y'all. Pray for our country. Pray for our president. And pray for me. Cause I need it pretty bad. Uh, I don't want to go into details of what, what, what's going on, but uh, my son could use y'all's prayers right now. Adios, amigos, and thank y'all for watching.